take you to some breaking news now out of France, where at least four children and an adult have been injured in a knife attack. It happened in the town of Annoncy in the French Alps. The children are all around three years old, and two of them are in a life-threatening condition. Police say the attacker is a Syrian refugee with legal status in France, and he's been arrested. President Emmanuel Macron has called the attack an act of absolute cowardice. A moment of silence was observed in the French Parliament. Well, let's speak to Natasha Butler. She's in the French capital for us. Natasha, what more do we know about this attack right now? Yes, really, this is uh, every parent's nightmare. A man stabbing children in the uh, early morning. Uh, police say that uh, the attack happened around 9.45 local time in France in the lakeside uh, city uh, of Annecy at the foot of Eyewitnesses described seeing a man climb over the fence into this playground, which is in the middle of a park in the town, and they said they saw the man lunging at some children. Well, one, one woman said that she oh. thought he was trying to play with some of the children, but then they heard people screaming and running away. So really terrible scenes there uh, in Annecy. Now, what uh, the French police are saying is that they have arrested a man. He was trying to flee the scene after uh, this attack. He is uh, a suspect. They say that they found an identity paper on him uh, which uh, said that it was he was a Syrian uh, asylum seeker uh, that who gained asylum in Sweden but was uh, based in France. He wasn't known, though, uh, to the police. So terrible uh, scenes there in this alpine city of Annecy. Just awful. Natasha, I see President Macron has already spoken about this. It's obviously potentially very politically sensitive, I imagine. Well, I think at this stage, there's just more a sense of shock, you know, amongst uh, the public. Uh, these uh, playgrounds that are in parks, you see them in every city, in every village in France. You know, in the early hours of the morning, it's summer at the moment. You know, parents go out with their young children and nannies and carers. The kids are in the sandpit or on the slides. The last thing that you could imagine mm. happening is the children being vulnerable to this kind of violence and this sort of attack. And we understand that at least two children out of the uh, several that were injured, at least two of them are in a critical condition. This is just a, a, a terrible thing to have happened and to children. As you said, some of them as young as three, year, three years old. One eyewitness saying that she saw the man also lunging at children in a pram. So people incredibly oh. shocked here in France. MPs in France's National Assembly had a minute's silence. And the French president, uh, Emmanuel Macron, has called this attack cowardly. And I can imagine that many people uh, will agree with them as they try to absorb this violence that has happened, as I said, with such young people, so vulnerable, just children. Just awful. Natasha Butler there with the latest for us from Paris. Thank you, Natasha.